This project really was a once in a lifetime opportunity. But the risk of failure was very high. And the journey, it was very difficult. I went to Taiwan to visit my friend Rebecca. She had told me about this amazing tree in this remote valley that she had found. And naturally, as a big tree lover and photographer, I just had to go there, explore and photograph this tree. Usually when I go and photograph a giant tree, I have weeks if not months of time to prepare, plan, install the camera system and just basically wait for the ideal weather. But because this trip was so complex with so many people and in such a remote location, we could only afford four days on site. And that was four days to get everything done. So there was a lot of pressure to just keep working, keep finding solutions to problems and get the job done. The hike to the tree was the toughest big tree trip I'd ever been on. We climbed all the way up to 3,300 metres. And just for context, that is twice the size of Tasmania's tallest mountain. But it wasn't over. Then we had to descend 1,300 metres into this very steep, off-track and very cloudy valley. It was definitely the most difficult big tree expedition I'd ever been on. When I first arrived at the tree, I was so impressed. The tree had fused with this cypress and both of the stems just towered up into the sky. But it was the complexity of the lower forest that really took me by surprise. We have very beautiful big trees and forests here in Tasmania, but Taiwan, the forest is just so completely different. I just couldn't believe how beautiful it all was. but we were there to work and we were there to climb.
Not only was the individual tree just so incredibly beautiful, but the surrounding forest and complex environment that surrounded this tree really did make this project very unique. This project was the most difficult, but it really was a testament to the crew that came along on this journey and their belief in this project and the photo that really pushed it forward. I dedicate this tree to them and their work. This really is Taiwan's tree.